in EVH for the 21st century. What's up everyone, this is Jordan at the Music Zoo and I'm here today to present the brand new Wolfgang Van Halen Signature SA-126 Special. It's his first collaboration with the EVH brand. It's his namesake, it's a very special guitar. There's a lot of cool features, let's check it out. So I think this is a really interesting guitar for Wolfgang Van Halen and EVH to put out. Obviously you want to pay tribute to the legacy of the EVH brands and everything that Eddie did, all those really incredible innovative features that he brought to the guitar market from the 70s onwards, but obviously Wolfie's his own player. He wants a guitar that's going to perform what he needs on stage with his band Mammoth. And so what has he been playing recently? Semi-hollows. So it makes sense that his first signature would be a semi-hollow. But it's not just any semi-hollow, this is a bolt-on semi-hollow, which I think makes this quite a unique offering. So overall construction, on this one you have a quilt maple top, there are some solid color options. We have plain maple, chambered mahogany body with a basswood centerpiece going through. On the back you have a bolt-on mahogany neck topped with an ebony fretboard. You got 22 frets, jumbo frets at that, so if you're tapping, you want to do those really fast modern lead lines, perfect for that. Has a compound radius, these really cool mother of pearl, kind of like sp double split block inlays, which is a really nice pattern. On the back of the headstock, you have a really cool Stinger, EVH branded Keystone tuners. A nice modern touch right here is the truss rod adjust at the heel, so you don't have to take off the neck or do anything crazy like that, or even take off the truss rod cover. It's right there, nice and adjustable. Right here, you have two classic EVH features. The harmonica bridge, which is a design found on a lot of aftermarket parts from the 70s. We saw that on the EVH Shark guitar. That was a recent re-release. And right here are the humbuckers, where you see the pickup rings, but they're actually, if you look closely, direct mounted to the basswood center block, which I think adds in the overall resonance and sustain of the guitar. When you're plugged in, obviously the, the pickups are getting all that transference of the wood and pushing that through to your amplifier, giving the guitar just like a huge body and tone. The pickups in the SA-126 were designed in collaboration with legend Tim Shaw, who has designed some of the best pickups in the game from the 70s and 80s onwards. And I'm guessing that Wolfie wanted a pickup that's pretty versatile because that's the music he makes. He wants something that could do classic rock, modern rock, metal, gent maybe? I don't know, we could try. How do they sound? When I plugged it into that Friedman amp, they're really nice and full bodied. There was a ton of bass response without getting overly muddy. When I cleaned it up, going to the neck pickup with my volume road back, nice and glassy, bright, but not getting too dull. So a versatile pickup set for a very versatile guitar. One of the most important questions, how does the neck feel on the SA-126? I'd say it's pretty slim, a little bit asymmetrical. There's a little bit more heel on the bass side for sure. Um, it slims out towards the middle and, and kind of comes in on the treble side. So I guess that's good if you're doing a lot of rhythms, you want your thumb to have a nice surface area to get a grip on, but if you're playing leads and tapping and all that kind of crazy stuff, you're gonna have a fun time going up there for sure. Fit, finish, where is it made? Fit, fits great, I love it. It's nice and comfortable, lightweight, balanced. I love that the semi-hollow body is light, but like the center block and the mahogany neck kind of even it out. The finish, beautiful gloss finish, quilt top, looks beautiful, right? Where is it made? It is made in the FMIC factory in Mexico, and it feels great right out of the case. Speaking of the case, it comes with a white Tolexed EVH hard shell case with a blue interior. Nice bonus, get the guitar, go straight to the gig, you're good to go. Who is the SA-126 for? I did think it is for players of all genres who want something fun, unique. Um, it's offering something new for the EVH line that I'm really excited about, for sure. It is not your dad's EVH guitar, I mean it's 2024, it's not even your grandpa's EVH guitar. It's your guitar, do what you want with it. You can tap on it, you can shred on it, you can riff on it. This is a very fun one. Congratulations to Wolfie and the EVH team for bringing something new to the game. Thanks for watching this video. Be sure to like and subscribe to our YouTube channel as well as subscribe to us at The Music Zoo on all other social media channels. You can get this EVH SA-126 right now at themusiczoo.com. We'll see you soon.